Assalamu alaikum. How are you all, my dear students? Hope you all are well. With you, I'm Samia Laboni. Welcome you to Bangladesh and Global Studies class. Very recent, we have completed the chapter 11 ethnic groups in Bangladesh and learn about them. Can you remember about their language, society, religion, festivals, clothing, housing, and foods? Now, tell me, have you fared well in your CST exam? I know you always try your best. Now let's start our today's class. Today we are going to start a new topic from chapter 12, chapter 12 Bangladesh in World Politics and topic 1 United Nations. From this topic we will learn about the world politics, United Nations, purposes of the United Nations and the six administrative branches of the UN. The practices of world politics are defined by values and these values are norms of human rights, ideas of human development and beliefs such as internationalism or the globalization. And if we relate to each other with our neighbors, we have to such these norms, right? That is why United Nations was formed was formed 24 October 1945 after the losses of the Second World War. So when was United Nations formed? United Nations was formed 24 October 1945 and after then in 17 September 1974 Bangladesh was joined to United Nations. When we own our independence, then Bangladesh joined in United Nations when 17 September 1974. Now the member states of even are 193. Now let's learn more about the UN. Okay. The United Nations is an intergovernmental organization that aims to maintain international peace and security, develop friendly relations among nations, achieve international cooperation and be a center for harmonizing the actions of nations. Do you know why was the United Nations formed? Yes. The purposes of the United Nations are to maintain international peace and security, to develop friendly relations among nations, to achieve international cooperation in solving problems of an economic, social, cultural and human nature, to be a center for harmonizing the actions of nations, to show respect on liberty and fundamental rights of irrespective of our nation, religion and caste. Now let's learn about the six administrative branches of the UN. General Assembly is where member nations meet to discuss and cast votes. Its session is held once in a year. A president is elected each year. In 1986, it was Mr. Human Rashid Choudhury of Bangladesh. Another administrative branches is Secretariat that handles the administration. The Secretary General is currently Antonio Guterres of Portugal. 
trusteeship council trusteeship council no longer meets and suspended its operations its purpose was to help new nations gain independence another administrative branches is international court of justice that resolves disputes between member countries in 2012 bangladesh won its case against myanmar about rights in the bay of bengal economic and social council economic and social council aims to improve economic development and end poverty literacy and unemployment last administrative branches of un is security council that is responsible for peacekeeping and defense bangladesh has sent her soldiers and police for peacekeeping missions in many countries of the world bangladesh became its member two times as a temporary member do you know there are five permanent members like uk usa russia china and france from today's class please try to remember all the things that we learn see the learning flow chart for better understanding of your learning process for this chapter until now If you find it difficult to follow the video you can always pause and watch the screen to make it more understandable. This is all for today's lesson. You have to study well from the given lecture sheet and worksheet number 1. Have a good day. Take care and keep learning. Assalamu alaikum.